Так, це мій. Окей, this one is mine. Олеся Вікторівна. Special vests, helmets and gloves. Volunteer firefighters here in the Rasosha community in the Khmelnytsky region of Ukraine are trying on firefighter gear gifted to them by the U.S. Forest Service. Thanks to the U.S. Forest Service, we were able to get some vital equipment like motor pumps, chainsaws, walkie-talkies and specialized coats, boots, gloves and helmets for all the volunteer firefighters. The Rasosha community is made up of 26 villages and is home to 11,000 people. It's where the All-Ukrainian Environmental League, together with the U.S. Forest Service, is starting a community-based forest fire protection system. We are very grateful to the U.S. Forest Service for supporting this project at this time when our country is at war during Russia's aggression. Seven locals have gone through special training and received volunteer certificates. We need to keep our community safe. I am talking about wildfire prevention, any emergency situations, natural disasters, anything can happen. But we need to be ready to help. And in case something bad happens, we need to help people. The volunteer firefighter movement had started before the war. We started organizing people in volunteer brigades. Now most of those guys are at the front lines. But we had five, seven, maybe eight guys from each community who said they wanted to help us. The All-Ukrainian Environmental League, together with the U.S. Forest Service, helped revive Rasosha's volunteer firefighter movement. Volunteer firefighters are our first helpers. They arrive very quickly if there is a fire. Until the government firefighter truck comes, they can start putting out the fire, maybe eliminate it altogether. Every year we have over 50 emergencies, fires, accidents, and now, during the war, it's worse, there's constant shelling. Our people need to be the first ones at the scene. Dyachok says the community hopes to attract more volunteers and organized fire safety classes in schools. The community's biggest dream is a new fire truck. And they hope, with the help from the U.S. Forest Service and the All-Ukrainian Environmental League, their dream will come true soon. You're my sweet darling. For Tatiana Kukurika in the Khmelnytsky region of Ukraine, NRI's viewing news.